Hello everyone, my name is Lexi and welcome to my channel. To start things off, I would like to say that yes, my hair is different again. I keep changing it, I don't know if that's going to stop anytime soon, but I am the same person. For today's video, it's just going to be a quick one. As you can tell by the title, it is my room type reveal. got the email this morning from Flamingo Crossing, so... Now I know what type of bed I'm going to have and I know what to buy for it. I originally had a bed set set aside for the room that I wanted to get, but I did not get it. I actually got my third preference as my first one, as like what they gave me. So if you watched my previous video, then you would know automatically that that means I got a 2x2. Two two. So it, that just essentially means it's like a dorm. I'm going to have another person living with me, but there's a little barrier that divides us and I'll be in a twin extra long bed. And the bedding that I had set aside for it just in case was a full slash queen, so I think that's gonna be a little bit too big. So today I plan to run to Target, some other stores, and see if I can get a new bed set for that. I have a lot of plans in mind on how I'm gonna make the space just more open. Light colors are really a good way to go. And I wanna get wallpaper to put on the divider just so it's not like a brown black board in the middle of the room and keep it prettier I guess you could say. Hopefully I find out my work location reveal within a week. So I'm really excited to share that with y'all. The room type was not what I wanted and I was really disappointed in it at first. And it probably seems over dramatic but I was really sad about it because I just wanted my own privacy. I had a bad experience with sharing a room back in college and it's not something I wanted to deal with again but after like having my own little pity party, I took a step back from the situation and I tried to realize how grateful I am just that I got into the program and the fact that I can bring my car. That's been really hard for a lot of people to do. So I'm grateful I can bring my car. I just listed all the things I'm glad about and the room I'm in is the cheapest room. I think rent is like 185 or 195 a month. Meanwhile, like the 4x4, which was my top preference is 225. So I'm saving money in the long run. I'll have more money for groceries. And I know that's the most common room type, so I'm excited to share with y'all what I do to make my room more comfortable and maybe give you some inspiration if you end up living in that type of room. I think making a list of all the positives is a really great way to get through it if it's not what you want. I'm just very grateful to be a part of this program to begin with. I do leave very soon, and I'm glad at least I don't have a preference really for work location type. I'd be grateful for literally anywhere because I love all the parks. So I'm excited to share that with y'all as soon as I find out. Thank you so much for watching this really quick video. So if you guys have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. And I can't wait to see you in my next video where hopefully I'll finally find out which park will be my home park. See y'all later. Bye.